Hey, so today, replacing a starter on a 2003 T1N Sprinter. I got this starter off Amazon for $31, $31 and change after taxes. It was like $34 and some odd cents. So how I did that was I looked on Rock Auto. All the options were between two and 300 bucks. I said, no way. I went on Zimolata's, uh, I don't know if that's how you say his name, but Zimolata, this guy on YouTube, has a sprinter channel, and he does a lot of sprinter stuff, and he said he got a $45 starter on Amazon. So this was a couple years ago. Since then, the prices have gone up a bit. In any case, I looked on Amazon. I found a new starter for $77 or $78, bucks, and there was a used like new option. I've been doing this a few times, and usually it's just a beat-up box. In this particular case, this starter has been installed and used at least once. Uh, that being said, you know, if it's not good, Amazon will guarantee it. Uh, it's been ran at least once. The flywheel here had some gunk on it from whatever it was put on last. Other than that, it's it was clean. Uh, my, you know, my gloves made it dirty. But uh, everything is as it should be. So anyway, going to stick that on. So how to get this guy off of there. I, uh, I went through the side and I used an impact. It, the, these, these bolts stuck in the aluminum don't like to move. So I used an impact with a swivel and an E, an e socket. I think it's 14. Um, a long extension to get out those bolts there. They're right here. One's there, one's there. The starter sits up in here like like this. To get this guy out, you'll take the bolts out, slide it forward, pull it down, gently bring it through all these wires and hoses without tangling nothing up, and it'll get to about here, about there, and then you can, from the side, take off the nuts and get all the wires done from there. So from here, I'm going to put those wires back on. Push it back up in here. It's actually going to slide. It's going to slide back up in like this through here. And then, uh, am I pointing at myself? There we go, yeah. It's going to slide up in here through here. And then back up in. Two bolts with anti seize. Everything should be good to go. If for whatever reason it doesn't work, I'll update the video at the end. But. You can go on Amazon and you can replace your Sprinter starter for, I think it was like $31.68. There aren't any used like new currently available, so you might have to wait until another one pops up to get that opportunity, but uh, it's definitely worth checking out. 